Hello, my name is Joshua Bay, and I'm a public benefit specialist at Tegas McGinnis Elder Care Law, and today I'm going to talk about the renewal packet. The renewal packet will be sent to the address on file. It may be sent to the home address, the facility, or the authorized representative of the TenCare member. The renewal packet will have the TenCare member's name on the first page. It would also have a barcode with the name of the member under the barcode on every page. This is for tracking purposes at TenCare. The TenCare packet contains about 100 pages. If you're receiving choices one or choices two, you will need only eight pages. The first page of questions lets you know what pages you'll need, pages one through eight. Part one through four is really similar to the original Medicaid application. It asks general identifying questions. The remaining part of the application asks about changes to your income and resources. If your pension or retirement has changed, this is a great time to report it to TenCare if you have not. TenCare does ask that changes be reported when they happen. If your resources have changed since the approval, report it now. If anything has been sold, traded, or transferred, report it to TenCare. These changes should be reported for the TenCare member only. If no changes have been made, complete the application and send the application back to TenCare. Most of the time, the facility can complete the renewal application if no changes have been made. The application can be faxed to 1-877-430-0843. If you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call.